All right, guys, KB32 here, check it out. We're sitting at Mifflin County Sportsman Association. And what we're doing is we're testing out some loads uh, in accompaniment, in accoutrement with this new uh, scope by the guys over there at Primary Arms. Now this is their Platinum PLX, is the new one to eight by 24. And this is set up with the ACSS Raptor. This is their M8M, which means meters. <laughs> That puts us in a special neat situation where everything on the BDC is set out to meters. So 100 is not 100 yards, it's 100 meters. 200, 200 meters, 300, you get the drift. The neat thing is, is this range that we're on is set up in 100 yard increments, which is kind of cool because now I kind of have to do like we do in a competition. I'm gonna have to range it out, see what it is. So I've got a, just an Amazon special tack life uh, I believe the expensive ones at the house. So what we need to do now is uh, we're testing out the loads, which yesterday, believe it or not, man, I had a really bad day with these things. Uh, came back out, down, set it down in 0.2 increments, and uh, really and truly, the, uh, the 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 original loads that I had landed through the same holes. So uh, I've kind of gone forward and pre-tested these things. I took the liberty of setting out my targets out there. So we got some good clean targets. So we've got them at 100, 200, 300, 400, 500, and 600 yards. Uh, the wind is doing some crazy stuff today. You got a uh, rear to front wind that's blowing straight up the range, but then it's swirling back and forth. We got a couple guys over here that I've uh, talked to all the time. They're from Maryland and uh, they're up there working. So what we're gonna do, uh, I'm gonna start off with my original set, my mindset load, uh, and that is uh, the 77 grain, and I'm just gonna keep my load development stuff to myself, uh, simply because I think it's probably a little high, <laughs> uh, but uh, it works out. So what we wanna do is I want to test these bullets with the reticle on this range to see how close we are, because we are shooting the, uh, uh, Tar Hill Challenge down there at the uh, Clinton House. And uh, we're gonna see, hopefully, uh, it's gonna be the same way we do everything else. I mean, we'll arrange the target, put the numbers down on this thing, and we shoot. So here we go, let's do this. I got cameras up there, so you're gonna see the stuff before I do, which is gonna be a lot of fun. Back to what we used to do a long time ago, right? So the first target we're gonna do, I'm gonna laze this thing out. 100 yards is what, 90? 92.1, so rule of thumb, I'm just gonna aim at bottom of target and see where this thing hits because I'm more likely to miss a 100 yard target than I am a damn 200. Well, that was nice. We hit it. So that's a 10 inch circle, aim bottom of target, we know we're gonna hit it, not a problem. I would do that anyway with a 50 yard or 50 meter uh, zero. All right, so now we're gonna go out to 200. Got a camera on that guy. And I'm gonna, let's see where that thing is. Okay. 179, 180 yards. Again, we'll probably just aim center mass, a little below center mass on the target and see what happens. This is a good experiment for us all, right? What the hell happened there? All right. Okay, well, let's just say, I'm gonna do that again. All right, I'll take that. Let's go ahead and put a couple more rounds in here. Okay, so now what we're gonna do, we've got target set up at 300. Let's range that guy. Oh, I wish I had my Leica. Two seventy-five. 
All right, we're gonna put it on the 300 yard mark and let's see what happens. Oh, hello. That'd be really cool, huh? Wow. All right, aim the bottom of the target. All right, so bottom of target did it right there. We went over. Let's confirm. Not bad. <laughs> Man, I love shooting this thing. This is a great rifle. Proof research barrel, one and eight twist. Uh, you guys have seen the video on this thing. All right, so let's do this. At the 300, we want to shoot bottom of target, right? Remember that. You guys remind me of that later on, right? Here we go. Was that 300? Three seventy-six. Let's use that th same rule of thumb, man. Bottom of target, three hundred seventy-six yards. I might start using the reticle a little bit better here. Okay, here we go. The glass on this thing is just stupid. A little to the left. Hmm. All right, so we're out to 400, 375. Let's do this. I'm going to keep working on that 400 target. You know what? That thing's hitting right at 400 on the 400 mark. Okay, so now I've got a little target set up there at 500. Let's go ahead and bring her on up. Okay. I love this little tripod. This is the best thing they ever invented. It's hard to find them these days. They are out there though. 500, I got a little half ipsic target out there. Now it's a quarter ipsic. Oh. I'm gonna hold it dead nuts and see what happens. Not bad, that's 500 yards. That target's only about this big. <laughs> All right, so this is the, the kicker. I've got one up there at six. And I'm not sure, I haven't figured out how to hit that guy yet. Um, but let's just see what's going to happen here. And I think I'm done after that. I think what I want to do is check to see how this thing performs with the 55 grain. Um, but we'll see here. Hold on one second. I'm going to hold it dead nuts at 6. A little high. Hold it dead bottom. Bottom left. Oh shit. All right. We're elevation's good, so we're gonna hold it the bottom on the 600. I will tell you this. I'm getting about 27.50 out of the damn 16 inch barrel. All right. Here we go. bottom of the target there. Oh. There it is. Okay. So, uh, that's it. I'm not going to waste any more ammo. Uh, but man, 
How much fun is this? The clarity on this scope is absolutely stupid. They actually make a throw lever that's not like this stud here, but it will fold down. Um, I'm gonna do a full blown review on this guy. Well, a little more practice and we'll have some more fun. With that being said, guys, hope you enjoyed this video. We're getting back into shooting. Having time to set these targets up was a lot of fun. We're gonna go ahead and practice out with the 55 grains provided to the channel by the guys over there at Callaway Ballistics. Free shipping and order for $200 or more. Go to my website, kb32tech.com. Check out the link. With that being said, y'all be good. Uh, sport red, white, and blue. God bless America. God bless his men, women, uniform 24 7 for our freedom because freedom is not free. Give me 32. I'm out of here. I'll be good. Wow.